Ben takes a hard left, sending him flying up a ramp. Yeah, hard In left. Slow mo. Is that Tom Ben Diesel? Looks up as Brian's upside down car sails over his own. It's super sick. Brian looks back down at Dom. Their heads inches from no! each other. They crane no! their necks, upside down. No! What it is, guys? It's your boy Blasphemous HD, and today we're to check out some American Dad and try not to laugh at it for once. On oh, God, we gonna pass one of these challenge. I, I swear it. It just hasn't been good lately. Let's do this. Tell me, did you sail across the sun? Did you make it to the Milky Way to see the lights are faded and that heaven is One of those! My Rod Stewart albums! Lose them! Choke on my Rod! We've all done weird stuff when Francine was out of town, but don't call it a robot, and don't... What the hell was Welcome that? Welcome back. You were dead for a couple of seconds. I was dead? Yeah, we called your wife. She's on her way. Sounds hot. Okay, it looks like a left on Reservoir Lane. Never even heard of it. Let me see. Roger, this is a poster of Bo Derek. I know. Have you ever seen cheekbones? So look out! <laughs> I think we're safe. Quick thinking back there, Roger. Roger? Roger might be trying to kill us. And we have no brakes. Let's go get that money, people. Yeah! I'm on my way. Close your eyes, Steve. I don't want you to see me drive like this. It's my life and my dream. Nothing's gonna stop me now. Jeff, prepare to understand your first insult. And sin. Ooh. Her first. Jeff, prepare to understand your first. Insult. And. Jeff, prepare to understand your first insult. And sin. Ah! Oh, look, there's a Klaus. Best wish ever. Oh, my calves are getting tired. My calves. What the hell is okay. that? I'm not going to die. Not... Is that a penis? Some from the back. And don't forget the rack. <sighs> Damn it. And seeing the value of a good, well thought out. <laughs> the driver has now been identified as Jack Smith. Former jewel thief, bus driver, and seasonal evil spirit of Christmas. Oh, here we go! Oh, they got him! They got him! Yes, right in the face! I'm really worried about Roger, hon. I know what'll cheer him up. One of my patented funny faces. <laughs> My eyes are stuck! Dad! Roger! Roger! 
Doctor, get out of there! to prison! <laughs> Another semen truck? What's going on in this town? Are we on a shipping route? Son, I'm just going to the store to get some cigarettes. Never believe that! Don't fall for that! 18 years later! Out of town cigarette store. No, your son needs you. End the cycle. And you got the boot off Principal Lewis's car. So you've done a lot of good. Smith, meet me in the computer lab. <laughs> Goodbye, bad credit. Oh my God! Oh. Roger's love is keeping us aloft! We're gonna make it! So long, junk mail! Wait, what? This is more like it. So, straight to your place? Uh, going a little fast for the turn, aren't you? What the f Note to self, guys. If it's ever too good to be true, she's either you setting you up to get robbed, she's a prostitute, or she's already pregnant. Hey, loony birds! You like nuts so much, how about just f on these? Do you even have nuts? How dare you! If you're going to earn the family's trust back, you're going to have to show them you can focus while you're driving. Hey, look! A sign! He's still allowed to adopt? <laughs> Roger, goddammit, watch the road! I can laugh and watch the- <laughs> Whee! A little vapor rub will soothe me. Very hurt. We have to stop this. Truce. Truce. Hello, I am David. I am new to the neighborhood. You've struck my garage, and I feel as though we are not going to get along. I'm not gonna lie, that's probably one of the best pranks I've ever seen somebody do, even if it is animated. But you need to listen to me. Can you do that? Whatever you say, Stan. I'll do whatever you say. Take off your clothes. <laughs> do it! <laughs> Trey Jolie, Coco. Trey Jolie. Now take your thumb and put it in your mouth like a little schoolgirl. Damn it, Roger, we don't have time for that. Just take them off already. Fine. God, why do you hate movies? I'm praying to you. I can't die. I can't die out here in the woods. What the hell are you talking about? It's from my favorite movie, Miller's Crossing. Bravo, Joel and Ethan Cohen. I mean, there are some proud parents, huh? Some nachas for the Cohens. <sighs> we are positioned directly across the street from Clooney's hotel. Are they building a basketball court in his hotel room? Clooney has it written into all of his movie contracts. What do the Cohen brothers see in him? You see us as you want to see us. In the simplest terms, the most convenient definitions. But what we found out is that each one of us is a brain and an athlete and a basket case, a princess, and a criminal. Does that answer your question? Sincerely yours, The Breakfast Club. 
<coughs> I feel funny. <coughs> it must be the smoke inhalation. It's killing my eyes. Ah, oh, you know what I meant to ask you? How did we get out of there? I, I think we did some sweet maneuvers from that movie Backdraft. I never saw Backdraft. Me either. Ah! My dad's not gay. Yes, he is. That's why he can't accept you, because he can't accept himself. Like Kevin Spacey. In k -Pax. Yeah, I suppose heroes are just normal people who... Ow! Ah! What did you do that for? You already have the medal. I don't know. They did it in the movie. Oh! I mean, if we're gonna go for it, let's go for it. Oh! Fight him! Oh my god, we've been robbed! Come on out, you thieving bastards! Dad! Haley, you were elected family gun shield at the last family meeting. You're also in charge of the Netflix queue. Just know this. I never don't want to have kindergarten cop. I got a spot where no one gonna find you. Won't hear when I make you squeal like a pig, neither. What? Nothing. Deliverance joke. Oh, poor Ned Beatty. He can, he can play Rudy's dad all he wants, but when we look at him, all we see is him getting rammed in the woods. Ms. Blanche, back for another concrete convention. It's been ten years and three more Gary Marshall movies. Well, after pizza, we'll retire to my treehouse, watch an 80s crab fest, say Critters or Critters 2. But you don't have to be brave, you just have to look brave for your dad. That's the beauty of movies. I snip out the part where you were a raging Nancy sissy and edit it to make you out to be the hero. You can do that? Uh, yeah, Steve. I'm a professional film editor. I can do anything. Tyler Perry's movies are actually quite good before I get my hands on them. Your name is Sven Norkvist. Here, put this wig on. I always wanted blonde hair. Do I look like Rolf from The Sound of Music? Yeah, I, I don't know, kid. I think they'll go all the way to 17. 17? Ocean 17? Look, as long as that gang likes hanging out together, they're gonna keep making those pictures. I notice you call movies pictures. I do. I do do that. I'm so excited to share Das Boot with you. This is the greatest German movie of all time. Das Boot? If you don't count the Hindenburg footage. And wish activate. You know, it might not be that easy. This might be one of those dealios where you gotta learn a lesson before things go back to normal. What the hell does that mean? Like in the movies. You've seen It's a Wonderful Life, right? Nope. How about Big? Uh-uh. You saw Ted? No. Really? Look, sometimes in a movie, a person thinks they want something, but then... Oh, like in the Care Bears Big Wish movie. Okay, I learned my damn lesson. Lewis has my shit and I want it back. I'm not sure you have. You're calling your family shit. Luckily, I know an easy way to make that happen. I've been trying to think of a way all day. Surely it can't be that easy. As a matter of fact, it is. And please stop calling me Shirley. <laughs> how, how great is the movie Airplane? <laughs> so great. <laughs> <laughs> the pilot has an unnatural interest in that little boy. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't seem unnatural to me. <laughs> Brian takes a hard left, sending him flying up a ramp. Yeah, hard In left. Slow mo. Is that Ben Diesel? Up as Brian's upside down car sails over his own. It's super sick. Brian looks back down at Dom. Their heads inches from each no! other. They crane no! their an upside down no! kiss and dance. No! No! What the? There you have it, folks. The only thing scarier than the Callisto Protocol. Hot dude on dude action. Mm. I ain't gonna lie, man. I low-key wanna punch Steve in his mouth just for giving us that visual, bro. And what's messed up is I was so busy screaming, I don't even remember what it what happened, what he said. So now, since I wanna know what he said, I gotta go back and see the shit again. Whoever sent this to me, I should boot you just off general principle. Shit! Brian takes a hard left, sending him flying up a ramp. In slow-mo, Dom looks up as Brian's upside-down car sails over his own. It's super sick. Brian looks back down at Dom, their heads inches from each other. They crane their necks to steal an upside-down kiss, and Dom's tongue explores Brian's mouth. What the f Are you sure you read that right? Maybe it's a typo. I'll, I'll just flip ahead. Here we go. Interior, garage night. Dom stands behind a bent-over Brian and Tokyo drifts into his... Oh, that, okay, that scene goes on for like 
Ten more pages. Dudes, this script is full of extremely graphic gay sex scenes. Go, I'm my psycho. It sure has, Toshi, my friend. What the fuck? Hey, I understand Tosh. Oh, cool. Ah, the death of the drive-in. Harbinger of the slow demise of American cinema. The grand images, the big stars. Where did they go? Now everyone just sits at home. Now it's all TV, TV, TV. Wait a second. I have a TV! How could I forget you, my good time gal? Who needs the damn movies? Fifteen bucks to see who's chasing Ashley Judd through the woods? Movies are dead. Hi, sorry to disturb you. My name's Randy. I just moved in with my mom down the street. I'm throwing empties at your head. I was recently released from prison, and the law requires me to tell everyone within a two-mile radius that I'm a registered sex offender. I threw peanuts at you. I used to work over at the water park where I molested a ton of kids, but now I'm out, so we'll see what happens. I was going out looking for it when it was right down the street, what? living with its mother and watching The Sandlot on DVD. Ice cream and nap! What? <laughs> looking for it when it was right down the street, living with its mother and watching The Sandlot on DVD. Uh, Stan? It was right there and I couldn't even see it. Stan? I guess that's why it's perfect. You don't even realize it's happening. Stan! What? Steve just rode away in that pedophile's ice cream truck. Oh, my God. He had ice cream at lunch. <laughs> ah! I'm salt. All colonels have to wrestle me to get salted. Oh, there's so many people to thank. But I wouldn't be here without my elementary school gym teacher, Mr. Raggins, who taught me everything I know about seduction. Mommy, your mother live across the street. 1819 Blueberry Street. Every night they have a fight. This is what they said that night. Boys go to Jupiter to get more stupider. Girls go to Mars to be superstars. Rumble, tumble, strawberry shake, freeze! <laughs> oh, childhood. Such a sweet sexual time. Would everybody shut up? You guys got it good. I don't even have someone to sex it to. The only women around here are my mom and sister. The more things change, the more they stay the same. <laughs> <laughs> you said it, Stan. I think we both know there's always been something there between us. Well, now we have the whole house all to ourselves. She told me she was 18! Ah, oh, gross, Riesling. Hey. Hey, sweet bird. Look at me. I will make you cool. You really think you can, Roger? I know it. Hey, this feels good. Do you like it? Don't tell anyone. You'll get in trouble, too. Ah! Yeah! What a knock. What the hell? Sorry, can't ruin my rep. Don't worry, I'll make it up to you right now. Huh? Hurts less this time, doesn't it? Motherfucker, what? What's good enough for you is... Good enough for me, it's good enough. It's good enough for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah! yeah. Ah! Where's Sheila? I guess she left. Oh, good for her. You know, I'd walk into this office every day praying she wouldn't be here. She must have done it. She must have run off with that 10th grader she's in love with. I guess she doesn't want that. I get to be a golden girl? Cream-covered boy? Cream-covered boy! Wait a minute. This has to be a trap. But then again, it's better to know. You're not mad? Nah, I wasn't even covered in chowder for that long. Roger and who I assume are the other janitors licked it clean off me. Steve says Snot's birthday's coming up. Where to party at? Probably Pervert Park. It's always empty. Except for the pervs. But it's free. Although with the perbs comes an emotional price. This will not happen, Snot. Indeed it will, Steve. You won't know when it's coming, but it's coming. Why aren't you getting up? I'm waiting for my wrestling rager to go down. 
It's perfectly natural. My coach told me about them when I was having brandy at his condo. Roger. Oh! What are you doing in Thailand? Oh my god. It worked! Thailand, huh? I'd like three 12 year old boys, no MSG. I'm gonna kick your ass! Ah, no, 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 no! <laughs> Did I just beat that guy up? Of course. Losing my eyesight must have sharpened my other senses. Actually... Shh, look how happy he is. Especially my sense of smell. <laughs> you, sir, are a pedophile. Hey, little oh! guy. I heard your dad walked out on you because he didn't love you enough to stay. But I know what'll make you feel better. At that moment, I was 100% sure I was going to be molested. So you weren't molested? No, that wasn't until four or five years later. It was my first week at Christian camp. But I'm not ready to talk about Father Roy. Boy, he had a set of paws on him. What a summer. Does this bring back any memories? Oh, you want me to confront Father Roy about what happened at camp? Thing is, I'm not sure it was entirely his fault. I may have deserved it. In fact, I may have instigated it. Actually, Francine, I seduced him. I don't know why I wanted him, but I wanted him. There was no actual Stan, no! Well, I wanted them to listen to me. Didn't work out so well, though, did it? No, sir. There might be a lesson to learn from this if I were the kind of guy who could learn lessons. But lessons are not for me. Lessons are for schoolboys. Schoolboys are for me! Red light! Let go of me! This is stupid! You're stupid! I'm sorry that was unprofessional. I've been a bit consumed with one of my other patients. He's a complicated teenage drug addict who's being molested. By me. Why are we folding napkins? Because there'll be food and my boss likes to wipe his mouth on swans. What the hell is this? Metrosexual soccer icon David Beckham. I can't do swans, I don't know why. Look what I found. Dick Cheney's Blackberry. Oh my god, I smell shenanigans. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Ugh, it's four o'clock in the bloody morning. Hello? Um, British Prime Minister Tony Blair. Speaking. Guess what? What? Chicken butt. <laughs> oh! oh, sorry, Steve. I thought we were going down low. I'll have a Cosmopolitan. A Cosmo for the lady who changed my life. Just need to see some ID. <laughs> okay, here you go. Yeah, this is clearly fake. I'm gonna have to confiscate this. Dr. Ernestine Chow. But I need that to get into bars. Uh-huh. I could lose my license. What license? You're an alien. This is make-believe in our attic. We gonna have a problem? Roger, have you lost your mind? You know you can't let Steve's friends see you. Oh, Haley, they won't notice I'm not Francine. They're 13. They'll never take their eyes off my sweater meat. Oh, I can be very persuasive. Surprise! Look in your heart. I'm praying to you. Look in your heart. You can't do this. It's not right. It's but... a wrong situation. I, I couldn't help it. It's my nature. Somebody hands me an angle, I play it. I don't deserve to die for that. Do you think I do? This is not us. This is some hop dream. I'm praying to you. I can't die. I can't die out here in the woods. Well, shoot what him. the hell are you talking about? You know, I, I gotta admit, I was nervous about going there last night, but you were right. We were totally ready. Kind of like how you were ready for sleepaway camp in third grade, even though you cried in the car all the way there. How, how do you know that? Cheer up, Stan. Hey, watch this. So, uh, driver, you been doing this for a long time? Actually, my wife and I just moved out here. What? There he is. Hey, watch this, watch this. Think we can get two? Sorry, my finger hit the button by accident. What were you saying? Oh, that's okay. I was saying, when my wife and I first moved out here. <laughs> <laughs> that's I'm shitty. sorry, I was just overcome with joy. Anyway, you mind if I, uh... One, two, three, four! 307, 308, 309! About an hour ago, I heard somebody mention chili fries. What's happening with that? Roger! 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 Roger!
We'd all like to scratch our nose, Curtis. Feet, please. Thanks, Francine. No, it's me, Roger. I'm finally taking charge of this pigsty. Now I'm going upstairs to clean behind the bookshelf. Yes, Stan, there's a behind the bookshelf. I told you, Francine, it's too expensive. There they are. Do it. Do it. Hello, Israel? Yeah, this is your neighbor, Syria. Don't, don't look, don't look, we'll get in trouble. Look, I know we've gotten off on the wrong foot, but I thought we could spend the day together at Six Flags Istanbul. Yes, I'm serious. Don't you know I like you? Yeah, it's like-like. Yeah. Great, I'll see you then. Dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I'll tell you the tale, but it could take a while. And when you are done, we will make the beast with two backs. I can't believe you have to pay for wives. You're such a charmer. <laughs> oh, sweetie, what's the matter? It's a bartender's job to provide a sympathetic ear. Stan is completely stopped being intimate. Well, you are kind of on the downslope. You know, back home, I was a greeter at Philaxido. It's kind of like Walmart, except when people work there for 18 years, they aren't proud of it. <laughs> I got beat up by a taco. Boy, when Mom and Dad get back from their trip, they're gonna be pissed you turn the swimming pool into a vineyard. Hello, Argentina. Is your refrigerator running? No? Well, maybe you shouldn't have privatized your water and power department. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Oh, crap. What? What's wrong? Argentina just star 69'd us. <sighs> Is that bad? I don't get it. How this is that sounds bad? like a family thing. I'll leave you two alone. I feel so cooped up in this place. It's like a prison, except without the thrill of a daily cavity search. Can't believe I agreed to do this. It's different this time, Eileen. He's here, and you're gonna see him, and the boys are gonna see him, and you'll all know I'm not crazy, and we can be a family again. Oh, God, don't look, don't look. What the hell? No problem, got it under control. Roger, what are you doing? Is that gasoline? Mm-hmm. Windex is just a band-aid. I realize that now. There's only one way to win the war on dirt in this house. What if I performed the surgery? What are you talking about? It's a highly specialized operation. You don't know how to do that. True, but uh, I'm a fast learner. Roger, once again, great job on that surgery. Yeah, it was touch and go there for a while. But all's well that ends well. What's this one, Mom? That's right. Oh! Oh! oh. Her film made me look like a boring housewife who's only good at cleaning. Oh, that is an outrage. Thank you, Roger. You're a terrible cleaner. Look at this place. It's filthy. <laughs> yeah, that's a big, dirty S for schmutz. I'm still paying off that ab lounge you never used once. Hey, that was false advertising. If they call it a lounge, it should come with martinis and guys in ironic trucker hats, like on the OC, which I'm missing because I have no TV. <laughs> Heaven's gonna get two new angels. This is in case you get hungry on the way up. <laughs> oh! You snuck up on me, cutie pie. Say, you're just about the right size to fill that hole in my heart. Oh, you like Francine's muffins? There's more where that came from. You're gonna come live with me. I will call you Felicity. You're cutting into my business. Oh, come on. I bet if you let me inside your hard shell, I'd find a lump of soft meat. <laughs> that came out wrong. Let's talk this out. Please. Ah, oh. yep. Why does there everyone is. hate the Jews? Yep. Oh, and Francine, FYI, cheese nips are not the same as cheese its. I have a list if you're not going to follow it. Oh, Ernest and Julio Gallo, you make a glorious wine and a handsome couple. Gin is close. My Tanga radar is going crazy. Not to mention my Patronar. Get it? Like sonar. Steve, this is me sober.
Why would I wear a sailor suit to meet my real parents? You were kidnapped at a boat show. Your parents have a boat. They're rich. You want them to recognize you or not? You're right, you're right. Don't forget this curly blonde wig. Why would I wear a wig? You're Norwegian. Right, right. I'm not in this one either. How can this be? Look at little Stevesy sleep. You snooze, you lose. <laughs> and you'll be glad to know that a portion of your purchase goes to help foster children in the greater Lang... Uh, you lost me at help. Now to plant my vineyard. Uh, uh, uh. Homie, weak as Explain shit. Explain these foster thingies. Foster children? You know, wayward children taken in by families. When you say wayward, I hear eager. And when you say children, I hear migrant workers. <laughs> Isn't this fun? I want our relationship to be totally Gilmore. So, any cute boys in your life? I was just asking. You don't have to bite my head off. Teenagers. Drama! I'm assuming this is gonna go well, so I got us hot wings. There's $10,000 in this briefcase. <gasps> We're buying that hotel! Oh, Staniel! Get off me! The money's for you to get a new start somewhere. You're paying me to go away? You bastard! <laughs> you pushed me into this. I told you it would ruin our friendship, and you said, no, let's go, do it to me, so I gave myself to you. Why the hell can't you just let this go? Because you were my first. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Why is that legitimately sad to me? I couldn't even do that to a female, yo. Real talk. Like, if I smashed a female and found out I was her first, I couldn't leave her. Unless she acted like an idiot. In which case, I would leave her very quickly. As long as she was, you know, did what I told her. As long as she acted the way I wanted her to act, I wouldn't leave her. Right, foster children. Hard work builds character. Water break, boss? Oh, honey, don't call me boss. That makes me feel like some kind of monster. Call me dad. Water break, dad? No. Listen, you girls like studying different cultures, right? Uh-huh. Well, we're a culture. A gender and ethnic exclusionary hierarchy. Maybe you should study us. Say, tomorrow night at the house. That sounds fair. He makes a good point. I'll tell the Eskimos. Wait! Don't go! That little creep is living the star lifestyle I deserve. Well, he's gonna learn that he's messing with the wrong muchacho. Ow, ow, stub my toe, stub my toe, stub my toe, stub my toe, stub my toe. Stub my toe. Worst part's over, worst part's over, worst part's over. Oh, God, this bust of Ben Stiller is hideous. Who used all my cream rinse? Ah! Ah! What the hell are you? Yeah, can someone tell Snake Plissken here to back off? Sold! <laughs> I don't know where you're taking me, but God help you if there's no schnapps. Oh. Look at its magnificent size. I'm completely off my ass, and I'm barely down to the label. Ooh. Oh, that explains the total neglect and the increased tissue consumption. Kind of a downer that Steve caught him red-handed, though. What? Hey, that's why they invented therapy. Is this your first? Mine, too. I was hoping to be a little more financially stable, but you can't put off having sea monkeys forever. Oh, my God, my babies, they're alive! <laughs> oh, it's true what they say. The love is instantaneous and unconditional. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. Champagne for everyone. None for you, Romeo and Anastasia. Okay, just don't tell your mother. What? No! Oh! Yep, that's what happens. Yep. That's what happens. Yep. Hey, son, why don't you go inside and get some eggnog? Oh, really? Thank you. Just half a cup, though. I'm not that thirsty. Ow, oh, ow, oh, ew, ew. Look at this. Eight years of dead bugs. You disgust me. Now hold the ladder. I want to come down. And one, two, three. And one, two, three. And one, two... Hey, this area is for vineyard personnel only. We're from Child Protective Services. We received a phone call that the children under your care are being forced to work as your slaves. Why, that's absurd. These children are merely playing Happy Fun Vineyard from Milton Bradley. I'm having such a good time. I'm having a ball. Don't stop me now. If you want to have a good time.
I have no deal, friend, because I know you soak not me, but rather all those who have ever hurt you. He is musty. That's so true. That's so raven. We can at least take solace in the fact that there was nothing we could have done to prevent that. Hey, I'm the man of the house now. I'll help you. What's she like? Um, well, she's a cheerleader. Got it. Ra-Ra's like hunky jocks, right? Just do some push-ups. She'll be all over you, tiger. Great idea, Roger. Down low. Too slow. <laughs> <laughs> Poor kid. Never really had a father. Uh-uh. <laughs> Not till you buy me a new TV. I will never buy you a TV. Fine, then you can walk home. <laughs> you idiot! Cops already? What, are we next door to a freaking Krispy Kreme? You're... Au revoir, stardom. Ah! Oh, did I tie that to Steve's ankle? Guess I'm clumsy like he wrote in the book. How do you like that ending, Steve? Roger the clumsy alien. Roger who sips his silly juice and goes on delusional rants. And it's not silly juice, it's necessary juice. I need a drink. Where's the booze? There is no booze. Saudi Arabia is a dry country. Seriously, where's the booze? Roger, do you have a boy crush on my grandfather? No, of course not. Why, did he say something about me? Okay, beast with two backs. Now. Oh, that's what all the fuss is about? Oh, yeah, okay, no problem. I'm never gonna be a star. People are never going to see me in Us Weekly and say, Ooh, Roger picks up a vase just like us. Ooh, Roger drops expensive vases just like us. Ooh, Roger's, Roger starts to black out just like... Yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah, blame just the like alien. Us. The cops will eat that up. Sorry, pal, you're going to jail where they're going to take your cherry. Jello. Away. In the lunch line. After you're raped. In the shower. <laughs> Lady Barkingston's bacon-flavored dog scones? Shit! Yeah, that was a genuine laugh, too. Damn! Oh! oh. The gypsy was right. This is how it ends. Fraternities. Bunch of lazy, immature guys getting drunk on every kind of liquor known to man. I mean... Hi, can you please help me? I'm not drunk. I had no idea. I wanted a buddy, but now I never want to see you again. <sighs> you were supposed to come after me! What? You crazy psycho bitch, leave me alone! This conversation isn't over! Yes, it is! Try to get rid of me? I'll kill us both! What the hell was that? Uh, I'm not hurt. It's a miracle! I think you're still on top of it. Back up. <gasps> oh my god, is it here? You're so adorable. <laughs> Give me silly juice and watch me fall down. What the? I'm ugly and my butt is huge. I, I, I don't... I don't get it. Watch your back. Ouch! Oh. Oh, that, ouchies! Ouchies! Ouch! Yeah, the kid's a total douche. And his voice. I'm Steve Smith. I wrote Roger the Alien. <laughs> I'm Steve Smith. I was never molested on the set of a mustard commercial when I was nine. Die, dream stealer. <laughs> oh my god, I, I killed Steve. <laughs> Oh, what happened to him? He got a full body herpes. Ooh. Oh, God, I forgot. That's where you humans keep your boys. Wow, this is so not how I pictured my first time. That sucks. Why wasn't I in any of those old family videos? Well, that's because all the footage was taken before you were adopted. What? What are you talking about? I'm not adopted. No, no, of course not. That'd be silly. You look just like your dad. Good night. Oh. Loosen up, Haley. There's nothing wrong with a good time. Try talking to one of the bros. You might enjoy it. Never! You hear me? 
Never! Well, that's a shame, because fraternities really do represent virtue, charity, and brotherly love. Masculine females. Ugh. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be playing foosball in the rape room. I'm the air marshal. Now, where is she? Oh, um, she's in the lavatory. Oh, okay. What are you talking about? I was just at the lavatories. There's nobody back there. So you don't know where Caitlin is? Of course we do. She's, uh, uh... Oh, my God, she doesn't know. She lost our daughter. Roger, cut it out. Uh, what's going on here? Where is she? Where is my little angel? Hold me back like Sean Penn in Mystic River. Is that my daughter in there? No, no, hold them back. Is that my daughter? No, hold them. Is that my... You are worthless. You feel that pressure on the back of your neck, Dad? That's the thumb of the man pressing down on you. I'm still the man. I'm gonna have that hydrant removed next Monday at the Homeowners Association meeting. Hey! Yes, the man gets the biggest piece. And you? You'll have this little piece. And while you're serving me, how about a little dollop of horseradish on the side? This is my horseradish! All of it. That's what happens. Yep. Well, you win this round. I'm gonna go to my room and listen to cilantro albums. Why is the alien dressed like a car salesman who's also a firefighter? El pero, el pero. It's my corazon. Uh, and Mexican. Okay, but racing's not easy. Not everyone has what I have with Flea Biscuit. We got a special bond, don't we, boy? Hmm. Yeah, well, I've got a special bond with my dog, too. Hmm. Whoa, Ryan. Oh, yeah, you're such a good boy, aren't you, Flea Biscuit? Good boy. Oh, you're, you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. Oh, yes, and you have a super active tongue. Oh, my. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna head home. Uh, let's get to work. Ugh, fine. But why does your mouth taste like beets? It's 9 a.m. Are you an early morning beet eater? That's insane. You're insane. But I'm insane too. Insane for that big beet flavor. You can trust me? So this is what you had to do instead of spending tree lighting day with your family? Oh, hey, Stan. Look, I'm sorry, but I gotta move a lot of cream to make my year-end quota. But don't worry, I'll get there. It's as simple as A, B, C, T, T, C, A, T, E, T, H, R. Always be constantly touching the customer and tell everyone they have rosacea. Matter of fact, have you ever thought about trying to address your skin condition? What skin condition? May I place my hand like this underneath your armpit? Our cream is fast-working and totally natural. You could eat it if you wanted to. I'm munching on the stuff all day myself. So how many jars can I put you down for, you crimson-faced monster? <laughs> Stop! Stop! Can't you see this man needs top dollar skin care? Don't worry, this borage oil scrub both exfoliates and rejuvenates. Mm, a lot of your skin is just coming right off. Okay, Deganya, this might be your toughest sale ever. What if... Stan. What the hell is happening? Damn. In a word, rosacea. It is a red tide on your face, my friend. One minute ago, I was on the couch. And then... Now, your girlfriend must complain to you about your rough, bumpy skin, yes? When she's close like this? You can make right what once went wrong. I'm being given a chance to save my family. You're being given a chance to save your nasty-ass skin with our jojoba-infused mud mask. Hot chocolate, popcorn, Santa's workshop. <gasps> what I the hell? This. I got this. May I place my hand underneath your armpit? I just had my colors done and Lydia tells me I'm an autumn. Roger, I've been standing with you here the whole time. You haven't talked to anybody and you're putting lipstick on your eyelids. You're just jealous. You know, if you fixed yourself up a little, men would find you attractive too instead of wondering if you're in the middle of gender reassignment surgery. Right, I'm on. I'm on fire. <laughs> Whoops. Nip slip. Dirty <laughs> 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 motherfucker. I'm so sad. Leave me alone. Is this your friend? Yeah. Lindsay, this is Roger. Nice to meet you. Charmed. And this is Jewel. 
Your date. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I'm out. I'm out. Hey, we had a deal. Steve, she's so ugly. So ugly. Too bad. Wow. You had a boyfriend? Oh, you, ha uh, you have a little thing. Oh, Roger, stop it. I don't have a hard time looking at you. At me? <laughs> I can see past your hydrocephalic head and into your beautiful mind. You're like Russell Crowe and I'm Jennifer Connelly. Yeah, yeah, you're Jennifer Connelly. No. Uncomfortable. No. I like you to take things slow. Whatever you want to me. Oh, Good so Lord. I can crate you and hide you in that warehouse at the end of Raiders? So funny. Kiss me, funny boy. I know, I know. Bad for the ozone. Don't be like that. You're not a loser. Think how pretty you make people look by contrast. That's yeah! Left. Yo! Yeah! Oh my god, you're an alien! Oh my god, Lindsay! Lindsay! Roger is an alien! Roger! She was all over me and my rig fell off and we'd be in big trouble! Oh god! They're doing everything we used to do together. These should have been my good times. I've seen enough. Drive me home, David. Yup, that is. I live right up here on the left. <laughs> ah! Shit, that made me laugh. Damn. Not bad for a La Quinta. A signing table. Nice touch, Roger. Hello, Chex. I see you didn't bring your barber this time. I guess you'll never ask me to be your plus one! <laughs> You're fat, Helen! You guys <laughs> thought I tried to kill you? Hilarious! <laughs> oh, it's, it's so therapeutic to laugh. Hey, does anyone have the exact time? 8.04. Thank you, my love. Ow, ow. Oh, my running regimen is killing my lower back. Oh, I gotta lie down. <laughs> You guys, yeah. up now. It's definitely over. Yo! He ain't shit. Klaus, where are you? <laughs> Klaus? Klaus, it's stuck. Get away! It's a trap. He's here. Steve, behind you. Stim, what's happening? Not much. What's happening with you? What is that? Is that Ace of Base? Roger! He's here! He's gonna kill us all! I don't know what song that is, but it sounds like something a psychopath will kill you to. <gasps> Stim's still out there! We have to find him and get off this space station! Let's split up! Whoever finds him, radio the others, and we'll meet up at the escape pod. I hope we don't get copyrighted for that music. Okay, Francine. I made it to the escape pod. I'm safe. What? Stan, hurry! We're Whoa. almost on the ground! Ah! Ah! What type of shit? Well, I did all I could. Whoa! Fresh panties for the ride home! Ow! Too broad or not broad enough? Because I've got some incredibly racist buck teeth in my pocket. You won't like yourself, but you'll laugh. I promised my Mr. Belvedere chat group I'd post a summary of this episode by six. 
Those losers are pretty punctual. You see us as you want to see us. In the simplest terms, it's... Oh my god, what is this and how can I replace my blood with it? Roger, wake up! I need you! Okay, here we go. I knew it was only a matter of time. What's up, us? You ignorant cretins! I'm more than just a clown! <laughs> I thought that was Hollywood make-believe, like children of every color being at the same McDonald's. Don't judge me, fatty! <laughs> My god! I'm ruined! Ruined! <laughs> Dolly Parton's theme park! The rides give you the same experience as looking at her. Fun from far away, but really scary up close. Whew, I'm thirsty from rocking it so hard. Who wants a Smirnoff ice and some bootleg Ukrainian porn? But life goes on. Well, that didn't solve anything. Guess I'll just go out and get hammered. <sighs> okay, your turn. Come on already! J-date, huh? Klaus, these girls don't look that desperate. Click on over 35 and never married. Jackpot! I'm gonna turn this cheese sandwich into a panini. Yes. Delizioso! I have to pee now. Whenever I get tied up, I have to pee. I'll try and hold it, but... I I'm going now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nice! <gasps> Madam, please uncover yourself. Does anyone have more areola pink? I only have one tube. Amazingly focused right now! Lavate las manos! Lavate las manos! Lavate las manos! You want some too? I got plenty for everybody! In the meantime, I'm gonna crack my first case. Inside are the most pathetic people in the city with nothing to live for. It's like Applebee's with a bar. Oh wait, Applebee's has a bar. It's like Applebee's. I shall not be denied my vengeance! <laughs> huh. Don't know why we didn't think of that nine months ago. I'm bored. I'm gonna speed up this sweater and pretend I'm in a dance club. G -g -g God rest ye merry gentlemen, I'm going to blow your ma a a a a a a a a a a a a a a ping ping pong pong ping 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 pong pong. Dance for me. Terrible DJ. Okay, okay, that's enough. I've got what I need. You are terrible. You've got no rhythm. No coordination. I've I've seen two epileptics share a bowl of noodles with more grace. <laughs> Manny, Petty, Sex Pun, I'm gonna need you guys to go give our guests their spa treatments. Oh, you can throw a knife. But you know what you can't throw? A party for my birthday, which was Wednesday. <laughs> I remembered yours. I told you it was complicated. No. Now, now, changing planes at O'Hare is complicated. This is... this is just... Franny, what is this? Look at this thing! Looks like a woman's baby cannon.
I know we're in the middle of a show, but that was American Dad's 1,000th vagina joke. Oh, my God! I can't believe we really did it. I mean, we're in Europe. Nine hours ago, we were in America. I, I just think we'll be better off. Oh, no, I get it. I get it. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Oh. 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 Exactly. I no no one wants that. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have farted before I started that walk. Wow! Do not go on the beach volleyball court. You hit that thing with a black light, it's gonna glow like a bedspread at Harrods. I'm writing down a number. I will not accept a penny less. A million dollars? Actually, if you look closely, it says a million doll hairs. No, it doesn't. Oh, well, that's what it was supposed to. Family photo! In three, two... Oh. Roger, I think we need some time. Yes. Yes, of course, I understand. Without you? Yes, of course. I'm sorry, but you've hurt us, and we can't see you right now. Ah! Ow, my foot! I'm bleeding! Get stopped. Hi. You can't have both. It's either us or them. Ah, oh, don't make me choose. I'm horrible at choosing. Choose. No, don't make me. You must. No, no. Them. <gasps> huh, I'm better at choosing than I thought. <laughs> You were his emergency contact. We didn't know what else to do. What happened to him? Well, take a look at this security video. He arrives with this family at 9 a.m. Churros, elephant ears, the whole nine yards. By 11 a.m., he was in line for the flume, which he rode 16 times, all with different families. Uh, two hours later, he's puss in boots with yet another family, eating a caramel apple, watching an animatronic bear play the fiddle. As the day progressed, he was with nine more families in nine more outfits, the rights to which I doubt he owns, uh, until we found him like this, gurgling, slumped over a teacup, and urinating on a pinwheel. I went on a family bender. I have a problem. <laughs> Help me. You hurt me. You hurt me bad. You made it impossible for me to have healthy relationships with other families. I need to know. Why did you leave me like that? You rented a room from us and refused to pay. I paid you in laughter! <laughs> we were afraid of you! Jenny, you better shut up right now or I will cut your face. Well, you know what? You missed out. These people, the Smiths, they love me with all my faults. What's going on? Oh, look, it's Tyler, all grown up like a big shot. You turned out cute. Real cute. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I'm, I'm laughing now because I'm nervous. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, boy, these khakis are not getting any looser. Let's go home. Hello, all. Well, you have the smoking down. What the hell? Why is he dressed? Why does he look like foot? I have everything down. Oh, do you? Indeed. What's my favorite breakfast sausage? Vice first. With? Sauerkraut. Also with? Hefeweizen. Baseball player? Sean Weiss. Tennis racket? Schlesinger. Made up word. Scheigelbarben. I have nothing left to teach you. You are ready for the inheritance, lawyers. Oh, wait, there is something else you should know. I bedazzled my genitalia. Ah, then we have a happy coincidence going on here. Mine says ABBA. Ambush, huh? Now that I think he got about jumped. there is one thing I left out. Back home, I had a terrible gambling problem. Owed a fortune to the East German Mafia. Huh. Yeah, I guess they were trying to smoke me out. Oh my god, we fell for that one, didn't we? <laughs> Use your board. Use your message board. How cute is Daniel Day-Lewis? Oh, good. The morphine is finally kicking in. Why doesn't Stacy?
damn think I have what it takes to be chairman of the Homeowners Association. All it takes is two hours on Monday night. I don't do anything Monday nights. Well, you clean my bowl on Monday nights. Humans are talking! Dad just doesn't get it. He doesn't even want to learn about recycling. Oh! Fudge maker. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Where's the cola? In yep, it's all about colon with these people. In the pantry. Oh, no! What? It's room temp. So put it in the fridge. Look, Stan will be home from the store any second, and I put grenadine on the list. Grenadine turns cold cola into a Roy Rogers. You know what grenadine turns warm cola into? You tell me when I throw it in your face. Yeah! Sorry I took so long. I farted pulling into the driveway, and I just wanted to enjoy it for a while. Uh, what? Is there another bag in the car? No. But there's no grenadine in here. You don't need grenadine. Yes, I do. It goes in cola to make a Roy Rogers. I had a Roy Rogers once. Hated it. Won't have it in my house. That and cilantro. Not the herb, the Mexican singer. He's gonna be huge and I want nothing to do with him. But that's not fair! No grenadine! I'm dying. No whining! Tell me, did you sail across the sun? Did you make it to the Milky Way to see the lights are faded? And that heaven is... What are those? My Rod Stewart albums. Lose them. Choke on my Rod. We've all done weird stuff when Francine was out of town, but don't call it a robot and don't. <laughs> Welcome back. You were dead for a couple of seconds. I was dead? Yeah, we called your wife. She's on her way. Sounds hot. Okay, it looks like a left on Reservoir Lane. Never even heard of it. Let me see. Roger, this is a poster of Bo Derek. I know. Have you ever seen cheekbones? So look out! I think we're safe. Quick thinking back there, Roger. Roger? Oh. Roger might be trying to kill us. And we have no brakes. Let's go get that money, people. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, damn. I'm on my way. Close your eyes, Steve. I don't want you to see me drive like this. It's my life and my dream. Nothing's gonna stop me now. Jeff, prepare to understand your first insult. And sin. Ooh. Ah! Ah! Oh, look, there's a Klaus. Uh oh. Ah! Best wish ever. Oh, my calves are getting tired. My calves. Yep. Ooh. Okay, I'm not going to die. Some from the back, and don't forget the rack. That's what you get. Damn it! And seeing the value of a good, well thought out. The driver has now been identified as Jack Smith, former jewel thief, bus driver, and seasonal evil spirit of Christmas. Oh, here we go! Ooh. Ooh. I'm really worried about Roger, hon. I know what'll cheer him up. One of my patented funny faces. Stay watch the road! My eyes are stuck! Dad! Roger! 
Roger, get out of there! I'm not going back to prison! Another semen truck? What's going on in this town? Are we on a shipping route? Son, I'm just going to the store to get some cigarettes. That's what they all say. Never fall for that, men. No, your son needs you. End the cycle. And you got the boot off Principal Lewis's car. So you've done a lot of good. Smith, meet me in the computer lab. <laughs> Goodbye, bad credit. Oh my God! I don't believe it. Roger's love is keeping us aloft. We're gonna make it! So long, junk mail! Wait, when did what? he become white? How did he. Oh my god! Fireball! Punch it, punch it, punch it! Yeah, yeah! Now! Punch it! No! You said punch it! The last one I switched it to meet break! Punch the break! Well, time for plan B. <laughs> <laughs> it's working! I love your outfit. I have to have you. This is more like it. So, straight to your place? Uh, going a little fast for the turn, aren't you? What the f Hey, Looney Birds! You like nuts so much? How about just f on these? Do you even have nuts? How dare you! If you're going to earn the family's trust back, you're going to have to show them you can focus while you're driving. Hey, look! A sign! He's still allowed to adopt? <laughs> Roger, goddammit, watch the road! I can laugh and watch the- <laughs> Whee! A little vapor- Shit! Bo rub will soothe me. Paper rub. <sighs> I am very hurt. I've had women do that to me. <laughs> Kinda hurts to laugh a little bit. We have to stop this. Truce? Truce. Hello, I am David. I am new to the neighborhood. You've struck my garage, and I feel as though we are not going to get along. I'll do whatever you say. Take off your clothes. <laughs> do it! Yeah, run the butt cheeks. <laughs> run it! Trey Jolie, Coco. Trey Jolie. You're gonna learn now today. take your thumb and put it in your mouth like a little schoolgirl. Yeah, yeah. Damn it, Roger, we don't have time for that. Time for that. Just take them off already. Fine. God, why do you hate movies? I'm praying to you. I can't die. I can't die out here in the woods. What the hell are you talking about? It's from my favorite movie, Miller's Crossing. Bravo, Joel and Ethan Cohen. I mean, there are some proud parents, huh? Some nachas for the Coens. <sighs> we are positioned directly across the street from Clooney's Hotel. Are they building George a Clooney. basketball court in his hotel room? Clooney has it written into all of his movie contracts. What do the Cohen brothers see in him? Damn. You see us as you want to see us. In the simplest terms, the most convenient definitions. But what we found out is that each one of us is a brain, and an athlete, and a basket case, a princess, and a criminal. Does that answer your question? Sincerely yours, the Breakfast Club. Don't. <coughs> I feel funny. 
<laughs> it must be the smoke inhalation. <laughs> it's killing my eyes. Why is he dressed like Doug the Body Hunter? Ah, oh, you know what I meant to ask you? How did we get out of there? I, I think we did some sweet maneuvers from that movie Backdraft. I never saw Backdraft. Me either. But my dad's not gay. Yes, he is. That's why he can't accept you, because he can't accept himself. Ah! Like Kevin Spacey. In k -Pax. Damn! Get up, buddy. Let's hit the beach. No, I, I mean, let's take the day to settle in. Maybe watch a movie. No, nope, I'm going to the beach. Sometimes I wonder where... Oh, come on, Stan. You really think this is going to keep me from leaving? Who I am? Do I fit in? Movie I've seen probably 250. Make believe in. It's hard alone. I mean, it's such a beautiful Boo! day outside. Out here on Boo! my own. Boo! Shut the fuck up! Play the good shit! Yeah, I suppose heroes are just normal people who. Ow! Roger, what did you do that for? You already have the medal. I don't know. They did it in the movie. Oh! I mean, if we're gonna go what for movie? it, let's go for it. Oh! Oh my God, we've been robbed! Come on out, you thieving bastards! Dad! Hey, Lee, you were elected family gun shield at the last family meeting. You're also in charge of the Netflix queue. Just know this. I never don't want to have kindergarten cop. I got a spot where no one's gonna find you. Won't hear when I make you squeal like a pig, neither. What? Nothing. Deliverance joke. Oh, poor Ned Beatty. He can, he can play Rudy's dad all he wants, but when we look at him, all we see is him getting rammed in the woods. Ms. Blanche, back for another concrete convention. It's been ten years and three more Gary Marshall movies. Well, after pizza, we'll retire to my treehouse, watch an 80s crab fest, say Critters or Critters 2. But you don't have to be brave, you just have to look brave for your dad. That's the beauty of movies. I snip out the part where you were a raging Nancy sissy and edit it to make you out to be the hero. You can do that? Uh, yeah, Steve. I'm a professional film editor. I can do anything. Let's Tyler roll. Perry's movies are actually quite good before I get my hands on them. Your name is Sven Norkvist. Here, put this wig on. I always wanted blonde hair. Do I look like Rolf from The Sound of Music? Yeah, I, I don't know, kid. I think they'll go all the way to 17. 17? Ocean 17? Look, as long as that gang likes hanging out together, they're gonna keep making those pictures. That's I notice you call movies pictures. I do. I do do that. I'm so excited to share Dust Bowl with you. This is the greatest German movie of all time. If you don't count the Hindenburg footage. What's Hindenburg and footage? And wish activate. Captain you know, Black Sparrow. It might not be that easy. This might be one of those dealios where you gotta learn a lesson before things go back to normal. What the hell does that mean? Like in the movies. You've seen It's a Wonderful Life, right? Nope. How about Big? Uh-uh. You saw Ted? No. Really? Look, sometimes in a movie, a person thinks they want something, but then... Oh, like in the Care Bears Big Wish movie. Okay, I learned my damn lesson. Lewis has my shit and I want it back. Not sure you have. You're calling your family shit. Luckily, I know an easy way to make that happen. I've been trying to think of a way all day. Surely it can't be that easy. As a matter of fact, it is. And please stop calling me Shirley. <laughs> how, how great is the movie Airplane? <laughs> so great. <laughs> <laughs> the I thought this has so an unnatural plain. interest in that little boy. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't seem unnatural to me. <laughs> oh. Brian takes a hard left, sending him flying up a ramp. No, 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 Dom stands behind a bent-over Brian, and Tokyo drifts into his... Oh, that, okay, that scene goes on for like ten more pages. Dudes, this script is full of extremely graphic gay sex scenes. Yo, how much is psycho, does it? It sure has, Toshi, my friend. Hey, I understand Tosh. 
こうやって話せるようになったからどうしても言いたいことがあったんだ。<笑>俺はパイレーツオブカリビアンが知る話だ。Who doesn't like Pirates of the Caribbean? Oh, cool. Everybody likes Pirates of the Caribbean. Harbinger of the slow demise of American cinema. The grand images, the big stars. Where did they go? Now everyone just sits at home. Now it's all TV, TV, TV. Wait a second. I have a TV! How could I forget you, my good time gal? Who needs the damn movies? 15 bucks to see who's chasing Ashley Judd through the woods? Movies are dead. Been a tough day for all of us here at the Glance. Steve Smith has now been missing for 36 hours. I'm joined by some of Steve's classmates. You look like the type of girls who do a lot of regrettable things. How does it feel today knowing you'll probably never get to hit that? Sad. Steve was really cute. I guess I just wish I could have hit that. It's so important to have sex with people before they go missing. Sergey backs up this statement. Very, very important to get inside of、uh, people's hella, hella before they go missing. Very important. Kiss your mother today and let her know. Let her know something. <laughs>、mm -hmm. All those girls want me?、Yeah, no. Awesome! The longer I stay in this cabin, the more late I'm gonna get!、Uh, yeah. Shit. More volume! I want it super big! <laughs> You're doing a great job. I know I'm demanding, but I'm working on it. But it also got me where I am today. So when I ask you to make it super big, I mean make it super big, I will murder you! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Work in progress. God is not finished with this gal. Hey, Genevieve, I'm all set to do my story on Garbage Island. Yeah, 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 we'll get to it. But first, I got an exclusive with the parents. Wait, what? And we're back. I'm here tonight with Stan and Francine Smith, heartbroken parents of America's missing son, Steve Smith. Stan? Francine? Why did you murder your son? What? Not ready to confess?、Oh. Let's look at some statistics. 100% of the time a child goes missing, the parents did it. Legally, not a fact. What are you talking about? And where'd you hide the body? We didn't hide the body.、Oh. So you admit there's a body? Why are you doing this? I'm sorry, it's been a long week. Emotions are running wild. Can I get you something? A beer water, perhaps? No, thanks. That stuff gives me diarrhea. Stan, are you close with your son? No, but that doesn't mean I murdered him. Interesting. Can we play that back? I murdered him. <laughs> you son of a bitch! <laughs> We have to take a break. Beer water. It won't give you diarrhea. Just keep it natural. You guys are doing great. You're coming off super likable. Francine, how many times did you stab your son? None! Huh. Well, my team and I created a reenactment of what we believe happened the night Steve disappeared. You know what I've been thinking about lately? How Steve is the worst? Yes, I kind of want to murder him. Great idea. We'll use my knife. Hey, Mom. Hi, Dad. Just coming in here to love you. I forgive you. Terrifying what you could do with B level camera equipment and very well thought out script. Thanks for letting me interview you for the Anne Rice fan club newsletter. Oh, no problem. How did you get my number again? Huh? Oh, from your high school principal. Yeah, huge Anne Rice fan. Total mo. Hi,、uh, reservations for two under Roger? We don't take reservations. Excellent. Hold up, hold up, yo. I heard there's a new badass driver in this mug. They call him the suit. I'll tell you something right now, he's crazy. Yo, yo, suit's in the house. Oh, hey, girl. Holla at you, boy. I can't wait to enroll here. People are finally going to take me seriously. Don't they have college on your planet? Yeah, but if you're not Asian, it's impossible to get in. Hey, Ethan. God, Ethan is so hot. And he completely ignores me. It makes him so much hotter. Why do women like that? 
What are you talking about? He totally ignored me, and I don't think he's hot at all. Ah, now I see it. Now I'm no, seeing it. No, I'm Professor Guggenheim. No. Wait, is there another G? Or is it... I'm Professor Baxter, and you'll be respecting me this semester. What are you doing? I went to talk to the dean. One lie led to another, and he asked me to teach this class. You can't teach. Quiet, please. You may have thought this class was about literature. You were wrong. This class is about life. Electric word, life. It means forever, and that's a mighty long time. But I'm here to tell you, there's something else. My office hours, they're Tuesday from 1 to 3. Mm -hmm. So, did you get that part on Ryan's Hope? No, they really like me, but they're going with someone a little more flesh-colored with a nose. Give it up, loser. Oh. I'm not a loser! <sighs> Disco's greatest hits. Best songs from 1974 to 1980. This tape is from the future, but that's impossible. On the other hand, I'm a spaceman working at Elaine, so maybe I should open my mind a bit. Congratulations, you just made your first million. I'm a winner, Ma! Look at me now! Now don't look for a second. Woo! You can look again, Ma! What? Steve said you were here. Mr. President, I have something important to show you. I hope you brought your checkbook. Uh, that's our maid. Oh, fun. I love Mexicans. Dude, that rocked. Who are you? I'm Krispy Kreme McDonald's. My Krispy Kreme mama got raped by my McDonald's daddy. <gasps> Sounds like an overweight porn star. We gonna edit that out. Get out! Get out of my bedroom! Roger, thank God! Where were you? You didn't come home last night. Oh, I was well looked after, Stephen. I found a new boy. A boy who won me something worth 750 tickets at the arcade. Oh. That's more than you make in a year. Boy, Ooh. I have never told a guy about my nose job on the first date before. It's a good first date. What do you think about maybe doing it again? Jerry, will you marry me? It's Shari, and yes! Oh, Jacob, you have made me so happy. Ma, you won't believe it, he asked me to marry him! Yes, the orthodontist, Brandeis! Reformed. Ashkenazi. Haven't seen the car. I know, is it great? We did it, Ma! We finally did it! Over here. <laughs> Ugh, what is that? A Manhattan. I feel great! Timmy, it's not nice to point. But he doesn't have a nose. Mm. He can't help it if he's deformed. Oh. Deformed? I'm just as God made me, madam. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. Bacon. Stir of Echo. Tremors won three Saturn Awards. What's a Saturn Award? You're missing the point. You're right. Sorry. That's Kevin Bacon. They think you're Kevin Bacon. Yes, Haley. I understand things that happen around me. Is it bad that he really looks like Kevin Bacon? Did someone order a sexy Persian wingman? Let's go. I gotta keep moving or these pants will cut off my circulation and my legs will die. I I'm just gonna go. Oh, thank God, that guy sucked so much. I only invited him because our folks had to escape Tehran together. We left everything behind, our house, our cars, my little brother. Oh my God, this is my song! I totally asked him to play this! What? what? What's going on? I'm Steve's cousin. I tripped on your walkway and I need compensation. I'll take a check. And I'll need two forms of ID. Passport's okay or a utility bill with your current... You know what? You're boring me. Make it a thousand cash. You get paid to look honest. Cup of your hottest coffee, please. Remember, you're the face, I'm the brain. Oh, this cup is irresponsibly hot. Oh, my face! Oh. 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 <laughs> exactly. God, baby, your back is so toned. Oh, my lats. Yeah, the electric can opener broke. I've been opening them manually. With these big, strong hands, oh, they make me feel so safe. Thanks. Cans again. I'll tell you the cans I like. Oh, sassy hands. Don't just get one cheek, girl. Other side. 
You poached my bear! <laughs> what the hell are you doing? I'm taking my bounty back! Ah! What's your problem? Oh, you mean besides being shot at by a bottom-heavy freak? <gasps> you know it's awkward when I try to jog! Recent rumblings from the art world suggest the market should decide this one. I'll be holding the auction this Saturday. <gasps> oh. Whoever heard of a sad clown? Will you tell my fortune? Steve, before she tells you your future, let me tell you her past. 40 years of alcoholism and three doctorless abortions. You are a sad, angry little person. Hello, sharper image. Yeah, give me three Sopranos pinball machines, the radio golf ball, a floating ant farm, a flashlight hammer to smash the ants with if they piss me off. I'm, uh, I'm gonna call right back. What the hell is that? Now, while I hacked the database, you created a diversion. <gasps> a diversion? Oh, this is a caper, like... Ah, uh, hate virgins. Maybe. In the movies. Speaking of movies, you ever seen Man on Fire? Is that the one with that? Oh, I suppose you have a better backstory? My name is Braff Zecklin. I was an international race car driver. One day, a baby carriage rolled out onto the track, so I swerved into the retaining wall to avoid it. The car burst into flames, but the baby miraculously survived. I was that baby. That doesn't make any sense. I'm Braff Zecklin! I'm playing poker tonight with a couple of guys from work. We need a fourth, so Chili's coming along. Chili? You heard right, baby. They call me Chili because I got ice in my veins. What's with these cards, Bad Larry? You're screwing me with these cards! D did I clean my toilet with a washcloth and then jam it into your mother's mouth? What? Because that's what you're doing to me! <clears throat> Hello to a well-behaved fellow who's very sorry. I'm very sorry. I know I've been a real pain, but I'm going to be super nice from now on. I trust you'll enjoy my spa, Mr. Stan Smith of the CIA. In fact, you'll like it so much, you'll never leave. <laughs> oh my god, you smell that? I had a pickle an hour ago. Came with my Reuben. I'm so fat. Now, who does Betty know me as? Cousin Phil, number 302. that woman's manipulative. She uses her personal drama as an excuse to come here, take over Stan's life, and elbow me out. Threatened by the visiting mother-in-law. Cliché. Oh. <laughs> Tacos! Oh. Who's crying? <laughs> I'll have you know I studied at the feet of the master, Dr. Phil. It's Oprah approved. Oprah, 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 Oprah! My card. The only currency I accept is the joy I get from helping my patients. This is a seven of diamonds. Yeah, you're gonna have to write my fake phone number down on that. Klondike 52487. I'm a ninja, everybody! I'm doing ninja stuff now! D-Day, 1944. You think about the bravery, the heroism that happened here. It's just humbling. Men younger than us, boys, really. Just boys. Trying to fight off an American invasion. I, I was talking about the Americans. Uh, the Germans were brave, too. Less brave, maybe. You'll be answering to Peters now. Give him anything he needs. Guess I'm the boss of you. What's your name? Stan. Hmm, I already know a Stan. I'm gonna call you Mortimer. Now run and fix me a coffee. Today, Mortimer James. I have the middle name when I'm disappointed in him. Name's Luke Fondelberg. Just started today. Any hot pieces of tail around this office that like a good groping? You see that episode of Seinfeld Thursday night ten years ago? You wanted to see me? Fondelberg, did you sexually harass Miss Vanderboobin? You bet your ass I did. I harassed the crap out of her. Damn it! Now we have to pay her a settlement. You're fired! Both of those things work for me. See you in hell. He's king. He's king. That spring break sucks. I could throw a better spring break than that loser. I'm Scotch Bingington, the true king of spring break. My scepter shoots shivers! And this end dispenses Luden's cough drops. I'm fighting something. 
What? <laughs> what, what, what's, what's going on? My tequila! That worm had a name! Now, if you will excuse me, I am late for my daughter's arranged wedding. She will learn to love him. May I help you? Yes, I'm looking for a Judy Panowitz. What a coincidence! Lonesome glove, why can I never find your mate? Did I donate it to that soldier I read about who lost his arm in Iraq? No, I would have remembered getting a sloppily written thank you note. I can't find my dinosaur stickers. Well, you'll have to look for them yourself. AJ has a boo-boo. I have a boo-boo, too. You did that on purpose. Roger! What the hell? I would have never... You're supposed to fight him for that. You don't let him do that. <laughs> Come down here if you hadn't declared this the summer of exotic adventure. Ah, Chinatown. Where you could tell me it was Japantown or Koreatown, and I'd nod and smile. Delivery for the Phantom of the Telethon. Oh my god, my pipe organ! Yay! This is what I'm supposed to play maniacally down in the catacombs? Oh, what'd you think you were getting for $39.95? No, no, this is totally unacceptable. Ah. Oh. 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 Yeah, I can oh. work with this. How often does Roger win free passes to a first-class spa? Oh, once isn't enough? No, Roger, I meant it as a good thing. Well, that's not how it sounded. Y you have a way about you, Haley, that just... Yeah, turns me off. Ow! She bit me! What? <gasps> you were gonna let me die for $1,800? No. Yes. No. Not now, Stephen. I have a meeting in, like, one minute. Pretend to be my assistant. And if this guy asks, my name is... Freddie Underwood! Porn screenwriter extraordinaire! Helicopter Perry, the sleaziest porn producer east of Van Nuys. Come here, you son of a bitch bastard! So, how's the smut business, HP? The internet's killing me, Freddie. Every frat boy with a digital camera thinks he's a filmmaker now. I've seen what you speak of. Dumpster sluts and the like. There's no art in it anymore. When can we see it? Oh, no, no, you will not be attending this abortion. Ugh, the director's an idiot, the lead can barely speak English, and the second lead is 30 pounds overweight. P.S., I'm the second lead, and I'm starving. Okay, first of all, I don't believe in any of this therapy nonsense. <gasps> the Logans! Oh, my God, the Logans! They were the first family I ever lived with, and then they abandoned me years ago, and I haven't been able to trust anybody ever since! Thank you, Doctor, you are a miracle worker! You see that, people? That's how you share. That's a freaking breakthrough. You make me sick. I need to know. Why did you leave me like that? You rented a room from us and refused to pay. I paid you in laughter. We were afraid of you. Bro, I've had people do this to me. <laughs> like you let them stay with you and you take care of them or whatever. And when you throw them out because they act like douchebags, they try to flip it and say, you did horrible stuff. It. It never surprises me, really. It's hilarious. <laughs> That's how you share. That's a freaking breakthrough. You make me sick. <laughs> I need to know. Sick. Why did you leave me like that? You rented a room from us and refused to pay. I paid you in laughter. We were afraid of you. Jenny, you better shut up right now or I will cut your face. If it's the same Roger who takes his pints down at the cat and the fiddle, he is prone to disguises. I also hear he's wanted in a string of prostitute murders, he is. On. And the club foot. I have everything down. Oh, do you? Indeed. What's my favorite breakfast sausage? Vice first. With? Sauerkraut. Also with? Hefeweizen. Baseball player? Show and vice. Tennis racket? Schlesinger. Made up word. Shagel barbin. I have nothing left to teach you. You're ready for the inheritance, lawyers. Oh, wait, there is something else you should know. I bedazzled my genitalia. Ah, then we have a happy coincidence going on here. Roy Rogers McFreely is the name, chairing the Homeowners Association's My Game. Yes, I know what you're thinking, but the jacket is vintage. You won't be able to find one anywhere. I need to have this form signed by the owner of a real business. This is a real business. To wit. Ew, it's filled with fingernail clippings. I mix them in with the wasabi peas. No one notices. I also have a business license. Probably should have started with that. Fine, Mr. Calhoun. I'll get right on it. Great. And after that, you can clean my pants up, because I just missed a Belvedere myself. Google it. I am Dmitry Garabedian, a high-ranking member of the Armenian Mafia. 
Roger's place pays us for protection. You recognize this woman? That's Constance Mathers. Where did you get this picture? The security camera. So I killed her. You can't do that! It is already done. Captain Francois Dubonnet, French Interpol. I have devoted ten years of my life to toppling your criminal empire, Madame Marouche. Your reign of terror is over. And I am Raoul. You are too old and barren. I am leaving you for a real woman who can bear me a son. Damn, her titties long as shit. I once knew a female whose boobs went to her kneecaps. When she came out of her bedroom, she was wearing a really long t-shirt that didn't go down to her kneecaps. But her titties did though. <laughs> And whenever she would walk, she would sway. And they would dangle like this far up under her shirt. I couldn't say nothing to her because it was my homeboy's sister. And it's messed up because I heard her before I saw her titties. And I was like hella attracted to her voice. And now it makes sense because if your titties is that long, your voice better be your fucking point. <laughs> yeah, you know I'm saying? <laughs> After like 30 minutes of flirting with this bitch, I turned around to see her long ass titties. And after that, she kept trying to hit on me because I was we were talking back nasty. And I had to just turn it all off. Just never talk back to her. <laughs> I can't even do it, bro. And I am Toro, Raul's half-bull son from the future. My father's other testicle became stronger, and he met it with a bull to conceive me. Are you Lucius Mayweather? Who wants to know? Roger, what What the hell? Roger? No, Lucius. You must be the white boy looking for a wheel man. I'm in. For God's sakes, I'm assembling my own crew. That cracker's got a crack in his head, if you ask me. You hustling me, boy? Barry, ah! Koshi, you know my uncle Roger. Ah! Uh, yeah, my mom's side. Ah! And what Steve wants. You hustling me, boy? <laughs> now is that I have my own plan. While everyone's focused on snot, I'll be heading to the bathroom to share a doobie with the busboy in exchange for an angry handy jay. I show hush bomb for the defense. <sighs> Don't you worry, kid. I'll win this for you. We'll get your foreskin cut off, all right. What? And who shot Gianni Versace? Was it a Jew? I don't know. It was in Miami. Mail call. Per usual, I opened and read everything. You're welcome. Franny, you got some cleaning coupons, because that's what you do. And Klaus, you got nothing, because people think you're dead. You know, you don't have to say that every time. You could just not hand me anything. I can explain. A DeLorean? <gasps> Are you running Coke? No. I get it. We'll talk later. I'm good for half a key. Tonight is going to be so much fun. I feel like the belle of the ball. Yeah, well, I'm the belle of the ball, so you can feel however you want. <gasps> Hello. Oh, I says hell. Half the petty officers in the 7th Fleet could have fathered that kid. Why am I the one that's got to pay to fix his cleft palate? But the whole thing was messy, so I jumped ship in Okinawa, caught a flight home, got back last night. Anywho, what's got you so glum? Oh, good lord, it's real. You know, Stan, it's too bad. I actually liked Francine. The rest of them can suck it, but Francine, I'm sorry to see die. Anytime I want, I could let out some bad wieners. Say, Stan, I'm the decider again. Oh, yeah? Oh, where, where do you keep these alleged death dogs? Well, they're not here. They're someplace safe. Someplace you'll never guess. The last place you would ever think to look. No, 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 don't look in the fridge. They're not in there. The hell in, why? Roger, let me go. You give me code now. 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 Now, now. Now, now. Oh, me now. Oh. Now. Now, now, now! Oh! Yeah, 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 yeah! I'm waiting for my buddy so he can tell me if these look good. Should be just a few more minutes. You know, you don't, you don't need to stand there. I'll, I'll tell them you helped me. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks. Are we gonna fool around? Only the best for my good friend. Friendly locals. Hola. Stan, put my brooches in the room safe. Okay, you were right. 
They were gonna kill me. Is that P? I can't believe you sacrificed your helicopter for me. Is the whole place peed on? I sacrificed it for my friend. Who peed on the city? Stan, Stan Smith. I, you know, have, I'm having trouble getting his voice right. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna make him sound like Sean Connery. Sweetheart, I'll have a mango teeny shaken, not stirred. Stirred. Is that how I say it? Stirred. Why are you still here? Is food appropriate for a small dog? Oh, ma'am, I'm not qualified to answer that. See, I only have one mouse on my name tag, which means I do stocking, lifting, and the like. You need to talk to someone with at least one dog. See, it goes one mouse, two mouse, one bird, two bird, then one dog, then two dog. I hear there's a guy up in Portland with three dogs, but I think that's just an office rumor. Wouldn't it be something if it was true, though? Hey, Roger! What's going on? Not much. Just boring myself in this old broad. Relax, MC Roggy. Let it go. Are you kidding? Nobody cuts off Biggie Smalls. <laughs> hey, jackass, you want some of this? Oh! 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 So first, just a medical oh, question. Where have you been going to the bathroom? What? It's just that these are new socks, and I paid extra for monogramming is all. See? That's not a monogram, that's a penguin. My name is Dr. Penguin. What's happening? I was just about to do something really funny. I'll tell you what's happening. It's the end of the world, and we've been left behind. Oh, my God. The homeless guy from the bus station is hung. But I knew that. Whoa, is that rich? Can't have too much of that. Another very bad race, Clancy. I'm Clancy. Sorry, Mr. McCormick. We'll do better next week. Unfortunately, there isn't going to be a next week. Mr. McCormick, no! Ah, uh, sorry, Clancy. The only way I can recruit my losses on this horse is to shoot it in the face and collect the life insurance I took out when I married it. What? Uh, Mother... Hey! I didn't get to do that earlier. Stop telling Francine on me! Ow! So we just gonna breeze past the fact that he's boning the horse. We just gonna breeze past that. Okay. All right. Okay. No, I, I see. Jeez, that really hurt. Ah, oh, crap. Can I help you? I had an appointment with the horse whisperer. Oh, yes, he'll be right with you. Thank God I'm just his secretary. I'm an associate. Oh, boy. What type of Cut. shit? Cut. Awful. Who are you? The name's Ira Siegel. Why is the fat guy the female? <laughs> oh, God. I directed the episode of Sybil, where Christine Baranski sat on her balls. Point is, I can direct this thing. Look how many pockets are on his jacket. I think we should let him do it. I know who Chex Limino is, and you're not him. That's because you're not seeing me in my outfit. Eh? Yeah? Recognize me now? Mustache, courtesy of an L.L. Bean mannequin, name of Frederick. Ah, uh, an alien and a mannequin. What were we thinking? We were young. The Smithsesses takes the precious from us. The Smithsesses. <laughs> oh, shit. Precious is ours. As... Oh, what a beautiful ring this is. Wait, this turns people invisible? Who needs to be invisible in the middle of nowhere? Where were you when I farted at Danny's wedding? No! Steve! Roger, help! Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, please, no. No, no, no! Oh! I'm falling! Somebody, please! My name is Clive Trotter, and I'm an American, and I am in trouble! Lucas, how'd you do? Oh, that's excellent. I probably got an A, though. You should study with me next time. Maybe order in a pizza and a two-liter? What do you like, Sprite? I sure do. What? No way! Wait, why is this wrong? Next to Miranda writes, I put Miranda has the right to a decent man who will help her raise her baby. Are these questions not about sex in the city? Lucas, why won't you tell me what kind of soda you like? If you had been in that parking lot, you would have kicked that mugger's ass. He humiliated me. I'm tired of being weak. Help me! I've been waiting to hear those words for a long time. I just pray they would come from my son and not an alien in a sports bra. It's a support tank. It's too small. It rode up my belly. 
So, you wanted to have lunch. Well, here I am. Thanks for ordering me a drink. That's the cream. That explains why I went down creamy. This is exactly what we're talking about. Stan, will you put mine on? You've made me so happy. Look, they've got a wine train. We can ride. Wait, can we ride it? It's a small train that goes through the vineyards and carries passengers. Yes, we can ride the wine train. Choo-choo! Don't do that. You guys see my rad new camera? I'm pursuing a newfound passion. Crime scene photography. Ooh, like the guys on CSI? Yes, Klaus. Remember we were watching CSI together and I was like, I want to do that. And you were like, you totally should. Ring a bell? Not at all. Are you sure you weren't just high on angel dust talking to the ceiling fan? Oh, that's right. Hello, y'all. I'm Stan Smith's brother, Appleby McFridays. Do I smell kreplach? Hey, Rabbi, I got a joke for you. Two priests are hitting on an altar boy. Uh, hello, guy who mistakenly believes he's my brother. Roger, what happened? Well, I guess sometimes a hole in a men's room stall is just a hole in a men's room stall. I've got a plan. Does that plan include explaining why a footless blind man is giving an expert Bajowski to our baggage handler? Expert Bajowski? Admire the skills. I want a roast. Roger, do you even know what a roast is? Of course I do. I was a member of the Friars Club in the 60s. I drove Phyllis Diller to two of her first three abortions. She must have such regret never getting her driver's license. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have my bowling league tonight. I'm a rolling turkey tonight, Hesse. <laughs> Why? Why would you do this? What, what did I ever do to any of you to make you say those incredibly hurtful things? Are you serious? Does it look like I'm not serious? Who's that positive girl with you? This is Allie, my life coach. She also works at Jumbo Juice. She gave me a fiber boost, then she gave me a life boost. Shit, looking like that, she could, she could work. I got some work for her. <laughs> yep, oh boy. She has weird energy, doesn't she? No, no, she has <gasps> good Haley. energy. Haley, no, it's Roger. Roger, can like I call that. you back? You don't have to. I'm right next to you. You didn't see me setting all this stuff up? Now we're in the same scene. <laughs> Thanks, Don. I'm done with this. Roger? What the hell are you doing in Thailand? Oh, my God. It worked. Thailand, huh? I'd like three 12-year-old boys, no MSG. Usually when I see men in cages, they're kissing each other, and I'm throwing pesos at them. Peso! Kiss! Kiss! Peso! Roger, what are you doing? Signing you up for an adult literacy class. Nocturnal Petting Zoo. Get out of here! I warned you, Dugan! Dugan, there's urine in this bottle! How they do it, from Egypt to France, a big bold step called the Confidence! You're fired! You can't fire me from my own restaurant! Actually, it's all mine. The bank wouldn't lend you 50 cents. The restaurant, the truck, the napkin holders, they're all mine. But to show you I'm a good guy, I got you this. Ta-da! The perfect split. You like that? Get off my property. What can I get you, Mac? Uh, I'm meeting friends at... Can I use you, crap? Get out of here! There's a bathroom in the park. The service here sucks. Have you even seen a waiter? What am I doing? This isn't helping me. If that's really from our kitchen, then you can eat the plate. With a roach on it? Oh. Oh, God. Why is he eating the plate with the roach Delicious. on it? Delicious! <laughs> now pronounce you man, fish, and wife. Now for my payment. Mother Hog, hog. Pleasure doing business with you. All you need is a manager and you're on your way. I wouldn't even know where to begin to find it. Sweeps McCullough, talent manager. I used to represent every sitcom neighbor and sidekick in the 80s. I discovered Mindy Cohn, Willie Ames, the slow kid from Life Goes On. Was that a comedy? Was to me. Butterfly knife and a hustler. Thanks, Uncle Cappy. I'm not Uncle Cappy just yet. I still have to get drunk. Now I'd like to call Mr. Sugar to the stand. Guess who's the luckiest guy in the courtroom? Bert, because he gets to watch my big round ass as I walk to the stand. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Bob Danilou. I make gluten-free desserts. Not gonna lie, we're struggling at the moment. 
Oh my God, he is so guilty. You're voting guilty, right? You can't know he's guilty yet. Everyone's guilty of something. You're guilty of having incredibly kissable lips. Oh, they're plump and sweet like ripe cherries. I'll vote guilty if you want me to. Of course you will. But I've got a random question. Do you sell watch batteries? Get out. They're totally safe, and you look fantastic. <laughs> does liquor really do that? Like, does liquor really take an ugly person and make them hot? Farted. This guy! <laughs> Motherfucker. Hi, Sarah. Pete Pendleman, concrete man out of Sheboygan. Let's walk and talk. Roger? Damn it, it didn't work. Who's Roger? The name's Reaganomics Lamborghini, jacuzzi dealer. Want to smoke cocaine out of my pipe made from a Rubik's Cube? Ah! I remember the good old days when Twitter was just another word for late night beaver down by the creek. I me some peanuts and cracker jacks. I don't care if I... Wait, what are we doing? I want to talk about my dad. I don't even like baseball. Well, me neither. I thought you wanted to go. I'm Ace Chapman, star forward. But wait, does it have to be consensual sex? Yes. Okay, well then, you definitely don't want Ace. <laughs> oh, oh, don't take those. You will be conscious but paralyzed for 12 hours. Bing Cooper, sexually active high school senior. I've pulled more tail than a slow kid at a petting zoo. Have a good day at school, son. I'm already having a good day because you called me son. Now give me a kiss. Kiss me on the lips, Dad. I want that kind of relationship with- I'll punch a child in the mouth. With you. Punch him in the face. You thought about it, punch I him in the, it. Punch him in the face. All these people walking around without bags. Buy something, you're killing this mall! How's your pretzel? Good, I brought it from home. Hey, this feels good. Do you like it? Don't tell anyone, you'll get in trouble too. Stop! Where's Roger? I left in the middle of the song. It turned into all gibberish, and I won't be a part of it. Hey, Ginger Scoops. I was looking at nudie mags in that field, and I need you to check me for ticks. Anything? They're tough to see. You just concentrate on being the creative force God made you and leave the rest to me. To our new business! To our new... <laughs> These are a lot stronger than when I was a kid. Hey, Roger. Yeah? I'm rooting for you. I know, Steve. You always were. I knew it wasn't true. The classes, the girlfriend, the sobriety. It was all a lie. That's why I wasn't surprised to read in the paper that he had OD'd not ten seconds later. <laughs> Our next performer is new on the country scene. Give a warm welcome to Mr. Cuss Mustard! Thank you kindly. I love drinking and race cars and big old fat women. And Jesus is awesome, he rose on Thanksgiving. Ah, ah, you, I saw you. Hey, what happened to being a country singer? Oh, living the honky-tonk life was too hard. I'm doing calypso dancing now. Oh, damn it, Asian. Dad, I'm gonna be late. Yeah, say, could I get that sweatshirt back from you? It looks pretty nasty out there. Maybe I could just wear it and give it back to you next time. Yeah, it's just, it's kind of my favorite, you know, from college. I'll wash it for you. I just want to wear it for a while. <sighs> it smells like us. Ugh. No, 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 no. That's the dude no. I was telling. If a girl ever does that to you inside of your room, a girl that says that to you, you can pretty much just ask her to go take a shower with you or just to take off her pants right there. You about while we were playing army guys. Oh, the weird shorts no. guy. He no. comes in every weekend, tries on all the shorts, no. and never buys anything. Mm. Where's a mirror? Shorts. Shorts. And sexy. Shorts. 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 Sexy. It's magnificent. Where did you get it? Oh, I got a great deal. This limo company went out of business. Ah, oh, you know damn well I stole it. You doing the Nigerian medical student? Yep. First one in my village to pretend to become a doctor. Name's Dan Ansom Handsome. You're the most stunning woman I've ever seen. Ah, uh, I'm Scarlet.
It's almost ready. Just need to do the final test. What did he invent? Fentanyl or something? Good lord. Yes. Yes, Perfect. Indeed. Yes, my son? Roger, what are you doing? While well, you were talking so much about this, it sounded like fun. It's not, but it was a good excuse to work on my abs and my savior bulge. Jeff, you don't do coke, do you? Cool, me neither. Quilo! Quilo, cape or no cape? Which one of you doesn't want the cape? Oh no, we both do. We're, we're just arguing about who loves them more. You won't be undersold. Try this same camcorder at Monty's for $20 less. Do you have your receipt? No, I don't have a receipt. I stole the floor model. You can't be the masked hero. I refuse to answer any questions without my lawyer present. <laughs> a bird distracted me on my backswing. It was going, kick, kick, kick. That's not my name, and it was saying it right at me. Yes, yes Mr. Mr. Vanderhill. Vanderhill. Oh, oh, my God, you stupid bitch. Why did you drop me? I can't breathe. Why can't you do that move? You stupid bitch, I'll kill you. How long has this been here? Construction of the museum began in 1998. I should know, because like Ross on Friends, I'm a docent. But unlike Ross, I don't look like a Monchichi. Somebody beat up Snot! Uh, aren't you Snot? I'm Barry! Stan, I might have got the wrong one. Dmitry Crutch licked me off. New exchange student from Russia. A uh, word of caution, I would refrain from sharing popcorn with a gentleman to your left as I saw him cut a hole in the bottom of his bucket. Aha, he's kidding. Popcorn? Don't worry about the boy. He drives so smooth you can boil an egg on the engine. When we bring the car back, I'll peel the egg for you. We're not having a real conversation. <laughs> no, you're, you're just waiting for me to finish so you can say your next thing. Freddy, you know Spencer. Oh, come on, man. You don't have to do this. <laughs> Bro, the reason why that made me laugh so much is because I feel like when I be talking to a lot of people out there, they get that notion from me. Like, yo, we're not having a real conversation, are we? You're just, you're just waiting until I stop talking so you can say your next line. Because <laughs> that's exactly what it is. <laughs> that's <to hate. laughs> Oh, man. Facebook is all about reconnecting. Alien? Is that you, baby? Alien. Come on in. You're safe here. I will not send you back to Cuba. Ricky Smash. Ricky Smash. Motherfucker. Ricky Smash. Oh, no. Ricky no. Smash. Well, that's, that's not that bad. Ah. <laughs> 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 97 Toyota Camry. Only 32 made in the world. Roger! Sam! Sam, mon ami! Hi, I'm Christopher, and this is my adopted daughter, Opal Louise. We are having quite a day. My Prius's nickel battery is acting up, my iPhone's as dead as Farrah Fawcett, and my life partner, Michael, is at a Grey Goose event in Reykjavik. Can I use your phone? Get in my house now. This place is just what Langley Falls needs. A chic lounge environment for young professionals. If they need it so much, how come there's nobody here? I'm going to eat you one day. Roger, what are you... No! Steve, I freaked out. Hey, babe. Let's go try that weird skiing that's like this. Remind me to never take this hat off. I got everything held together up there with a chip clip.
Hello there. I'm George Hamilton 20 years ago. Oh, my God, I loved you. Would you like to play a set of tennis? Actually, she's with me. Oh, I see. Hey, how about we play a new game? What's in our fanny packs? I have a scorecard from my last round of golf. I shot a 206 and a half-full Subway sandwich card. What's in yours? I don't think that's any of your... Zip! Well, that's a strange thing to carry around. I like to leave mine in the toilet. And now I'm going to turn on the water and you're going to feel a little pressure. Yeah. It's good. Real good. Mm. Uh, you can turn it up a bit. All the way. This ain't my first butt blast. What are you doing? What are you... Oh, uh, my... You know what, Ladon? Turn it down just a little. What's the matter, Franny? You look troubled. Sean Ian, I'm just going to adjust your arm to the right a bit. How does that feel? Good? Good. Okay, now I'm just going to put my thumb in your mouth. What? How does that feel? No! Good. Good. Shut it down, pack it up. What? Of course, it's not the original Niagara Falls, which burned down in 1816. This is getting ridiculous. You want me to walk you home again? It didn't help last time. Sheesh, just trying to help the kid out. I'm gonna rape him this time. Evening, sir. I'm here for Mr. and Mrs. For display purposes only. This is not a real cell phone. God, naked men look so stupid in shoes. I do look pretty dumb. Women look hot wearing only shoes. Yeah, because they make kick-ass female stripper shoes. Meanwhile, no one's making... Male stripper shoes? My eyes! Not again! Ow! 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 Look at this. What a cool biplane. Giuseppe, did you draw this? Si, si. Trace. I, I trace. What? I traced it. Mardi Gras, bitches! I'm having a party at my bar. I got beads aplenty, so I want to see all your tatas. Except you, Haley. You have the worst boobs. They're, they're like 90% nips. Like two dark castles with tiny little moats. Damn. 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 You were smashed, man. You kept high-fiving that black guy. He was not into it. My man! Up top! My dog! Twill Bone. It's just you? Where is everybody? Hey, could you pull over for a sec? I did it! Oh my god, what a gorgeous trophy! And flowers? Wait, I can't hold everything. I'm gonna have my friend hold my cone. It's five in the morning. What are you doing? Why, I'm getting ready to go to the dig site. Come on, Roger. What are you really doing? Well, why don't I show you? I, I knew we had to start south, where an ancient tribe would have a fresh water source. How do you know all this? Well, hell, Francine. I'm an archaeologist. Why do you keep leaning in when I say stuff? Take off your shirt and throw it to me. It's disgusting. You got the part. No, 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 no. Eyes on me. One and two and kick and tush and kick and push and finger, 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 finger. <sighs> well, that's over. Oh, damn it. Y you following my daughter? Screw you, buddy. Get out of here, you pervert. Your weird daughter made me miss the zeros. She, she made me miss the thing. You freako. I don't know what you're talking about. Get back in your house. Get back in your damn house. Relax. People will show. I mean, we're the only game in town, right? I mean, it's not like there's anyone else in Langley Falls working their asses off to keep alive the orchestral folk traditions of Tsarist Russia! Nerd Squad, I'm Trevor. Your wife called, your TV's out. Oh, Roger, awesome! I said it's Trevor. Wait, do you really know what you're doing, or is this just a disguise? Sir, I have a family, too, that I would like to spend Thanksgiving with, so if you could just show me your TV. Sorry, Haley. I've made other dessert plans. Haley, you didn't think I was going to let Big Wang slip through my fingers, did you? Come on, I still got two big installs tonight, but only one more job to do if you get my drift. <laughs> Gotta watch out for them Thai lady boys, man. Gotta watch out indeed.
What type of shit? Hey, you're not fencing. One. One. Unless he sent the spider to distract us from what he's doing behind us! Ah! There ain't even nothing there! This time! Ah! I'm done with surgery! I already lost the patient! Oh. You know, the thing about working in a hospital is if you don't have a funny black friend, things get pretty boring. Vanilla Bear! Let's go grab a beer and see what Carla and the mean janitor are doing. Ah! Take whatever you want! Wow! Racism! Ah! Ah! Oh, oh, oh. What'd you do that for? You scared the hell out of me! Okay, I think we can still sell this. Ah! What the hell? He stopped! Ah! I think... I, I think we lost him. Oh, That's not good. Do it! Yes! Egg whites? I'm gonna kill you! Um, what's going on? I'm super afraid. Egg whites? Who kills egg whites? Oh, snap. She a freak. Ooh. It's looks yeah. like Mom! Yeah. Ah! Hey guys! Ah! <laughs> 343. Just peed myself. Asparagus. Again. How is this just gonna grow bigger, bro? Like, what is he on? Cialis? Now, that's gotta be Viagra. That's definitely Viagra. This is why he's getting. <laughs> gotcha! Oh, that is terrific! <laughs> oh my god! I got you twice! Deuce! Deuce! <laughs> Nigga ain't shit! Where'd she go? He's super he ain't shit. He starts dinner at six. <laughs> I got you! She got me good. <laughs> Deuce! Deuce! Two times! <laughs> <laughs> okay, calm down. These hoes ain't a little shit. Rub will soothe me. That's proof these hoes ain't loyal. Why are you rubbing yourself? What what liquids was that? <laughs> ah! Let's eat. She ain't shit. <laughs> <laughs> Did we do it, Stan? Did we scare her? Yes. We did it, little buddy. Yes, we did. We scared her good. We scared her good. We got her. We got her. Damn. He's got really pretty eyes. Hello? Stan? Steve? Thank God, Stan. Ah! Entrail! Ugh. Steve? Right here? This is crazy. There's a killer on the loose. Ah! 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 What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. Take your butt cheeks. Now that's the fear I wanted when I was telling you we needed a better security system. <laughs> oh man, we got them but good. Did we ever? We got you so good. Had to teach you a lesson, babe. By the way, happy birthday. You probably thought I forgot. Two minutes till midnight. Swish. Count it. It's almost ready. Just need to do the final test.
perfect. Oh my god! Sorry, sir. We're closed for the night. Oh, I was just about to call you. I'm already down here. I came up with a plan myself. Uh... <laughs> oh, god. That's acid in your face, you fine-ass bitch! What's it, my love? What goes up must come... Yeah! Oh! That was unexpected. Once this sword is drawn, it must take blood. Oh! There's some dark ass shit right here. Different. It's always different. We saved kisses. Oh, thank you, Dr. Lizzie. Can I see him? I'll do you one better. Is it talking about a breast? Call him. Kisses. Kisses. It's Daddy. Come to Daddy. Come. To... What the f is that? Ew. Is that a chicken wing on his leg? Well, what do you think? What? Where are his eyes? He was blinded by the accident, so I removed his eyeballs and put them where his testicles used to be. Dogs deserve dignity too, sir. I'm gonna keep my record! Oh! Oh, I can walk again. I can walk! <laughs> That's you know, cool. We always carry it this way, and bad things happen. Why don't we carry it this way? That's so smart. I think we're going to get a promotion. Oh! My legs! It's a fit! Oh! When you snooze, you lose. Ah! Epic fail! Delmer, I just want to say you have been such a help these last few days. Dan, enough! We're going to deal with this now. Yikes. Time to go. Oh, that was fast. Hey, Carbuncle! Uh. Look at the bright They're side. They're gonna be vegetables forever! <laughs> I can't I can't believe I was gonna take your skin off. This is the skin for me. Hey babe, let's go try that weird skin that's like this. Remind me to never take this hat off. I got everything held together up there with a chip clip. Great. You hate it. Well, that's all right. I'm over you anyway. Steve was right. It was just a crush. Hey, Jeff, good news. You're getting your skin back. Gross. Son, I am bringing you to Mexico to show you that you don't need toys anymore. And by the way, father of the year here, this is how I wish I lost my virginity. Not to some coked up airhead. Didn't you lose your virginity to mom? Mm-hmm. Francine, the emergency fund. Wait, 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 what's the emergency fund? So I take $50 from your wallet every week. For? Drugs. What? Drugs. Drugs, okay? Francine, I can explain. 
At least when you wanted to get rid of it, it was about privacy. But now, trying to sell it to our Coke dealer? I see you don't have any principles at all. Oh, wow. Well, I'm gonna go see if I can sell Francine some drugs. Stick them up! This is a bank robbery! Ah! Delmonico? Francine! And who's this piece of ass? This is Jeff, my son-in-law. Jeff Delmonico, my dealer of drugs. Mm -hmm. Enchanté. Well, when you love someone, you have to go after them. Is that how you got Stan? Bitch, I look like this. Homegirl don't chase. Homegirl gets chased. Homegirl don't even have to work. Homegirl get that paper all on her own. Stop that. You're white. I'm homegirl. Hey, Mr. Fishburn. Yo, what up, G? Two fingers. The oh, last time I was here, he mistook me for Lawrence Fishburn, and I just never corrected him. I said two fingers, bitch! Now go be a father to your son, my strong black brother. Oh, my God. Is that Donna Nicole Marie Benelli? Hey, Benelli! You got a lot of nerves showing up here. So what? So what? Free what? So what? <laughs> Excuse me, Stan. That's the bitch who gave all my ideas to Michael Crichton. So what happened? Eh, wasn't her. Steve says Snot's birthday's coming up. Where to party at? Out of all the girls here, I pick you. I know you didn't just touch my hair. <laughs> Every time, stuck behind the crying baby. Miss, can you control your little girl because I... Oh, you are not telling me how to raise my child. You do not tell this woman how to raise her child. You do not tell her how to raise me. Mm -mm. No, you do not. You have no idea what this woman has done. I've been in a few fights in my day. About two hundo, maybe two fitty. How about I get you my favorite snack, a ballpark frank? I hate hot dogs. They remind me of uncircumcised penises. And you know I don't stand for no wormies. And I can't wait to write all about it in my health journal. Hey, I could join you. There's actually nothing in this bowl. You know what? That, that looks important. Okay. Can you hit the lights? La, 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 la. Nope. No. No. No, never go crazy. See, sometimes I escape to a little place in my head where no one complains about the meals I cook. <laughs> and there's no more scraping snot rockets off the shower tiles. No! And no more PB and J with the crust cut off. <sighs> Run, slut! Uh anyway, if you don't want to eat it, I can fix something else. Okra scrape? Yum! Yeah, I killed my college roommate. I can't believe you didn't know that. I stabbed her. Yeah! You're dead, Becky! Uh, where did the time go? Your daughter and I have just been fighting a lot, and I'm not sure she's awesome. Just say the word. Don't do it, Francine. All I heard was do it. Yeah! Honey, it's not loaded. Oh, I'm singing a summer day song. Now my little friend chirps along. Don't! So who do we have to kill? Joe, the activities director. Aw, but he's got such a sweet smile. I'm gonna shoot him in his face. Come on, what's so hard about it? Bam, bam, bam! I just killed that waiter, a baby, and a fat guy and a rascal. Okay, well, you figure it out while I take out these two. Bam, bam! Should have done that a long time ago. Well, I'd better run. George Clooney's head is about to have a big opening weekend. You're having a midlife crisis and you're taking it out on a future senator from California. Midlife crisis? Wait, future senator? Oh, I won't f chop his head in two! I can't believe we're burying this guy in the woods. I can't believe you guys didn't let me smash his teeth out and cut off his hands. What? 
You want to get away with this or not? She has a point. <laughs> I did to you what America did to Vietnam. I tried to control you, but no longer. I'm pulling out of you, Steve. I'm pulling out. I'm sorry if I hurt you, son. Honey, you are a great kisser. Don't talk like that, Bill. It's creepy. Shucks, I'm just kidding around. Francine tried to hide the cookie dough in the washing machine, but I found it. I always find it. Do I pause? Yeah, he's gonna sit down. Stan Smith! You bastard! How could you? Okay, you caught me, but can you blame me? It's just so sweet and tempting. <gasps> You're sick. You should be in jail. Oh, come on, you're overreacting. Roger does it too. Yeah, I've stuck my fingers in there. Hey, son. Don't sun me, baby snatcher. Something on your mind, champ? Steve, what are you doing? Something we've both wanted to do for years, sis. Motherfucker, what? Oh, my God. Everything that happens from this point on is just gravy. Ruby, what, are you saying there's no way to get Mauricio back? I'm sorry, child, but this spirit is not going to be satisfied until your mother is. And since your father isn't up to the task, I'm not sure who is. Well, uh... Oh, no, gross! I just need a new belt! Those lips, hips, and face, bodies all over the place, oh, yeah! Damn, that's my mama. Mm, damn, if that wasn't my mama. I had the dream again. Mm. The one about snot. But this time, my mom was there. She was super naked and sucking on a garden hose. Hey, stop talking! Oh. That was bought with dirty money? Ah, my art! You've destroyed my drawing of Haley! Haley? Uh, 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 uh. Oh, well, how about that one over there? Ah, that's my sister! Ah, oh, give us a look. Just let me make triple sure that it's her. Oh my god, they are really going at it. Oh my god, my parents are alive! Let's just confirm that it's really them. Babe. What? Why don't I just start a family with the couch? Hey, kids, how was school? Brush your teeth, stay off drugs. Hello, wife. Miss me? Huh? I missed you. Mm. Mm. Yep. Mm. Oh, man, the things I'm gonna do to you. Here, lie on your stomach. I'll prop you up with the kids. Stan! Yeah. See how weird it gets, Francine! Roger! What's up? You need weed? Get in the car. Ah, oh, he needs a little something else. I'm gonna go blow this guy. You on fire today, applesauce! STDs, nigga! What? That's what he means? What's this for? The van. It belongs to me and my new partner now. <sighs> 47 seconds. That is a personal best. Well, not counting Adam Levine's jacuzzi. But that time there was incentive. Only the blood of a pure maiden will appease the crow god and ensure a bountiful corn crop. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Pure maiden? Me? I had sex with a guy on the truck ride over here. And who was he? He had a crow mask on. It, oh, it was him, brown corduroys. Her talented mouth tells lies! They couldn't have gotten far. That's what I thought the first time Dimitri ran away from home. Found him in a Burger King restroom three towns over. Thank God it was a glory hole hotspot. Reached out to my vast network of glory boys. Within hours, I was relaxed enough to look for Dimitri on my own. Fine, if it'll shut you up, we can go there after the game. Thanks, Dan. Some road head to celebrate? Yep. We're gonna teach that lady how to please a man. Oh, I, I wasn't making a point. I was just low on potassium. What I do matters. What I do matters, too. All right, it really matters whether or not you run around all day blowing guys. That is only a very large part of what I do.
But we might be able to work something out if you're willing to do something for me. You girls head up to the room. I don't want you to have to say this. That won't be necessary. Oh. Here's 50 bucks. And you just bought yourself a ticket to stop. But I was only paying for the blow. That was free. Come on, Roger, pick up. Roger? Stan! What are you doing here? Uh, working. You? I'm freaking out. This cannot be what the rest of my life is like. I just need a quick little trip to the afterlife. Maybe visit a memory with a stuffed crust pizza. What do you say? Fine, I guess I can squeeze you in. <laughs> That's some glory hole humor for you. No. My jokes are what people show up for. The BJs are shit. Work hard, ah! play hard. It's the renegade way. Hello? Anybody there? Uh, hello? Damn it, wrong side. For a good time, call... Well, okay. Hi, it's Roger. Leave me a message. Hi, um, I don't usually call these things, and, like, there's no way you could know this about me, but I, like, always do the responsible thing. I'm Mr. Play It Safe. But I just told myself, out of your box, Roger. You know, if not now, when? It's time to start living, because this just in, nobody ever said on their deathbed, I wish I hadn't called that truck stop phone number. Oh my God, I feel like I'm rambling. I'm, I, I'm rambling, listen to me. But anyways, I'm here at the wall right now. Are you within striking distance or what? So I guess, yeah, give me a call, it'll be fun. What did I do, what did I do, what did I do? No, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Oh, voicemail! Oh! Oh, I am gonna give it to this guy. <laughs> well, there you have it, guys. A compilation so scary that it's scary. BJ jokes, people getting killed, all the sexy stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's your boy Blasphemous HD, Twizzles.